I wanted to stop and take time to explain this. People have been asking how come you can like just go down here and then you're very suddenly moving a different direction. See the thing is, the speeds and like which direction you're moving, remember everything's relative in space because everything moves in space. So when your frame of reference is curving, uh, when you're on the ground, you're moving at zero meters per second. When you take off, uh, you know, you start speeding up, and then when you get into orbit at like 2,000 something meters per second, you know, going around, right? Um, and for instance, right now, my frame of reference is, is curving, so I'm going at 335, 336, 333.7, I mean, uh, meters per second heading straight towards Kerbin. But, relatively, I'm actually moving at a speed of like 9,000 something or whatever. Because, look at this, velocity 9,979 around the sun. And the whole uh, solar system, the Kerbin system, is orbiting the sun. So actually, Kerbin, I can't show you because all this debris and junk but Kerbin has a velocity of its own and so when I'm in the sphere of influence because this game only simulates the gravity of one body at a time um, when I'm in Kerbin's this is the speed I'm going at and this is the path I'm taking but then if I were to of course right now because I'm gonna run into Kerbin I'm not gonna actually orbit and come back around um, but if I were to continue this orbit as it's projected, I'd encounter the moon. When I enter the sphere of influence of the moon, um, relative to the moon, I'm going this direction, even though relative to Kerbin, I'd be going this way. So I hope that explains that. And then right here, if I were to continue even further, I'd escape from the moon, and I'd be back in orbit around Kerbin going faster in a bigger orbit because the moon like the point I'm trying to make is when you encounter the moon relative to the moon you're going this way but relative to Kerbin you're still going pretty much the same direction and this is actually a great bit of film right here to show you this because if you look at my projected path I encounter the moon then I leave and I'm back in orbit of Kerbin so the path I'm taking if you're looking at this relative to Kerbin the whole time is I'm going like this, around, and then a little bit faster, speeding up as I go by the moon and coming back out here. Relative to the sun, of course, all of this is just kind of wavers in a straight line going across the screen, you know, actually this way. I was saying that way, whatever. But that's why you suddenly change directions in Kerbal Space Program. You're not actually suddenly changing directions, it's just the frame of reference you're using makes it appear that way.